Hi everyone, I hope you're keeping well. If you don't know, we won an APOD. Unbelievable. Uh, I recently did a collaboration with Joe from joesastrophoto.com and Russell Discombe from Russell's Astrophotography, both other YouTubers, and I'll put a link to their uh, channels in my description. But we collaborated on an image, the Crescent Nebula, and we won the NASA APOD, Astronomy Picture of the Day, which is such an honor. It's uh, been a bit of a whirlwind, to be honest. Um, so we got the APOD, which was mad, and we were all just completely over the moon with it because we didn't expect that. And then a day or two later, my sister rings me and says, oh, can I have your autograph? And I'm thinking, what are you talking about? Is that, you know, we've, we've already talked about the APOD. And then she says to me, you're on the BBC. So I jump on the uh, website and on the BBC World News, there we are. Astronomers awarded APOD by NASA. And it was all about our story of our collaboration and the picture that we did that, uh, that, that won the award. So it was amazing. What really meant a lot though was the amount of people from the astrophotography community that reached out and congratulated us on our achievement. It was really nice. There were some really nice messages, uh, lots of support and uh, real encouragement actually and supporting the fact that we'd done a collaboration. Um, yeah, they're a great thing to do and as you can see, uh, can lead to some real achievements. Um, when we first got together, we all chatted about what, what we're going to image. We needed something uh, that was going to be in the sky for all of us. Uh, Russell and myself are not too far away from each other, just a few hours. But Joe is seven hours away in Colorado. So when we decided on a target, um, it was Joe that came up with the idea of the Crescent Nebula. It had been an image that we'd all attempted ourselves individually and none of us had really ever achieved anything that we were happy with. I know I hadn't, um, but I really felt that if we pushed it and got some good data, long hours of HOO, we'd get that separation of the two colours and get the detail in both of those um, filters. Joe and Russell were like, OK, well, we'll give it a go. And uh, I must be honest, a lot was against us. The weather had been quite bad for all of us and um, the, it had cleared but unfortunately we all had near enough a full moon which uh, is not, as most of you know, ideal for astrophotography. It washes out the sky and I started off with a Bortle 6 sky. Luckily though the crescent is a long way from the moon and we was all shooting in very low uh, uh, nanometer narrowband filters. So I was at three nanometers, I think Joe was at five and three, but he's got bought all three skies. And um, Russell was on 3.5 nanometers. So it was all very narrow, narrow band imaging, which helps a lot. So we all got together, jumped on Pixie site, got it edited and we were all absolutely over the moon with our picture. We thought, wow, that's brilliant. And we were happy. That was it. That's all. That was it. We were just going to put our videos out, put our picture up, and that was it. Joe said, let's put it up for NASA's APOD. And we thought, yeah, why not? You know, we didn't expect it to uh, come anywhere. And then, wow, literally, Joe put it in and got an email back the next day saying that it was going to be the NASA APOD for the 17th of June 2021. Wow. Um, and then it ended up on the BBC World News. Wow again. I, I can't believe it. And then my social media went for a little mini meltdown. Lots of messages, lots of really lovely support. And uh, I can only say thank you ever so much for all of that. It means the world. So. Um, no pressure then for the next picture. Just wanted to share with you uh, the moment that we all came together after we'd found out we'd won the APOD, uh, just so you can have a look at our reaction. Hey everyone. Hi guys. <laughs> hey. Congratulations. Well, well yeah. Yes, that's what congrats. Got. Congrats on the APOD guys. <laughs> what an absolutely wonderful achievement. I can't believe we did it. Yeah. I still can't believe we did it. Well. Amazing. I wanted to say thank you to you both for helping, you know, make oh, that happen. Oh, same here. It thank was, you guys. It was a really good, uh, fun project to do. <laughs> and to get that at the end of it is just the icing on the cake, to be honest.
Yeah. Yeah. Well, I mean, I submitted it as an APOD, but I never thought about it until we actually got to the point where we we were uh, processing the image, and it was just like the the best image I'd ever seen. Uh, well, I think what the great thing do. we were both we were all so happy with the image. You know, to, to get an ape on on top of that is just like wow. Yeah. wow you know, <laughs> um, yeah, no, really, really, really happy. Such a nice yeah. honor. It's it's great fun as well. Just to just to do it. So to yeah, like you say, just to get the ape pod as well. It's just yeah, amazing. Can't believe it. Yeah. Well, it's a good team. Well, we'll have to honor. we'll have to we'll have to maybe go again <laughs> sometime. What do you reckon? Yeah, I'm keen. Yeah. yeah I mean. No pressure, of course. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna have to pick a target later later in the fall and, and do a really nice What's that? Winter, What's the fall? Winter target. Are you coming in here with your American <laughs> stuff again? <laughs> and this isn't fair, I'm outnumbered two to one. <laughs> <laughs> we we call it the autumn. The autumn. Okay. No, not autumn, we call it the autumn. <laughs> <laughs> o o autumn. <laughs> <laughs> Just see what I have to put oh, up with you, yeah. Russell. It's like this <laughs> all the time. So there you have it, and it just uh, remains for me to say thank you ever so much for all of the support that you give. Um, if it wasn't for your support uh, on my YouTube channel, uh, I wouldn't have met Joe, I wouldn't have met Russell, I most probably wouldn't have an A-Pod. So I really do want to say thank you because it means a lot. And uh, I hope that I can keep making content that uh, keeps you entertained or at least helps you on your astrophotography journey. So um, until next time, take care and clear skies. <laughs>